Yeah. With Kyle Bowen. Also in on debut tonight for Melbourne United. Here's Dalla Vadova for three. That's the focus for oh. Dalli. Two point ball game. Adelaide doing all they can to come up with their first win of this young season. Dalla Vadova from outside. What a hit from Dalli. That just shows where his confidence is at. Doyle elevates. He's off the mark. So the one of three from long range. Kept alive by McVeigh. And Doyle just mishandled it there. And Melbourne are back after it here. And chance to go quickly. And why not when you've got range like Chris Golding does? Melbourne's got five in that category. Defense is on top from both sides. 90 seconds played, term number two. It's Melbourne by three. Deliver Dover looking for his first field goal. Finds the target. And Melbourne United are going to have to adjust here now that they're over the limit in terms of fouls. Deliver Dover. Good pass for Hook Courtney for the nice finish. Great find from Delver Dover. Sobey with it. Game number 250. Again, the pass deflected. Delver Dover giving him all sorts of problems at the moment. This is Krebs against Norton. Gets the job done. But they did exactly what he said on overtime. Get the catches close to the rim. Just couldn't finish. And another big night. It might be for Luke Travis. Done a good job in the eight minutes that he's played. He's only taken three, three point two roll attempts. Just Delver Dover. Shot gets it done and called for the foul. Team foul a minute or so ago, and they haven't used him. Now fouling as he's shooting, you're going to send him to the to the strike. What Jordan Hunter does when he comes off that, he goes so hard to the basket. Oh, Delva Dover finds a part to the basket at the other end. Delva Dover, under 90 seconds to go in the first quarter. 22-12, the Breakers lead. Delva Dover doing it himself. But rather than the flex cut, they go and they down screen for the shot. Beautifully executed. United from the baseline. Oh, just got that in. Delva Dover. Getting busy on Scott scores. Delhi on the inbound. See they, see they, they, they bit on the guy coming out as well. And as such, Delhi just steps in and it's a scramble. So physically and racking up these fouls and getting into the bonus situation as Travers puts it on the deck. His Delhi Dover shot clock about to expire. Tough shot, but he has got all the answers here. Well, it's not just the free throw line, one of seven, like you mentioned, but 0 of five from the three point line as well as Daly gets into the paint. Oh, timeout coming here with Melbourne score. Oh, the feed from Daly, and Travis hands the triple. Thing run. Great action from Melbourne over the shoulder from Daly. That's beautiful. The vision, the awareness. See, you got to know your player and you got to know the personality. And okay. And can you trust him? Some automatically assume it. Nice pass. Talk about alley oops and finding people around the rim. Oliver Dover and Shay Ely. This time it's Delhi on the Harvey Norman replay. Just throwing it up in a perfect catch and throw down. Has 13 and is the game's leading scorer. Yeah. We're tied at 27. And Andrew, this is a danger when you don't take advantage of vulnerabilities early. And that's an outstanding finish. Melbourne United, Gary Clark putting on a show. Let's have a look at what took place. It's great hands, great catch, and they worry me. It's not a knee on knee, it's on the landing, I think. So maybe a twist on the landing on that left knee. They're the ones that were. And Clark led to that easy attack with the left hand from Travers. You gotta be more decisive and communicate better, and that's inexcusable. Della Vadova continue to provide. Is inexcusable. For all the praise we give Gary Clark, it's sometimes it's the very small things on a poor free throw. And after Melbourne made a fast start in the second quarter, Jack Jumpers are having a good couple of minutes. Della Vadova falling away. That's tough. He's For Delavan over, that's 12 on 5 of 10 from the field. Golden getting ready to check back in. It may very well be the last roll of the dice for Melbourne. Not if Delavan over's got anything to do with it. Or a poor one, he's conducting himself really well. Extremely well. And Clark into the game. Is Delavan over top of the key? 40% across.